guys, so we're going racing today, and uh, we're gonna check out to see how the BMW CCA goes. We're heading on down and running a little light, so I'm trying to get there quickly. <laughs>
guys just wanted to kind of finish up this video because uh, I didn't end up um, kind of concluding uh, the uh, the track day so uh, as you guys saw I kind of got uh, uh, in trouble for uh, being too loud so it kind of just ruined the day for me I just kind of was like you know what I'm just going to drive around and just do what I need to do to finish off the day and I kind of checked out a little bit, um, which is why this video isn't very long. Um, but, uh, you know, I'm making this video, uh, you know, months in advance or, you know, much later. And uh, at this point, we did do some things to quiet the car down. So from right now, the, the car is much quieter than it was during this video. But, um, you know, overall, the track day was it was fun. I mean, it sucked because what was the point right like I had to just kind of just kind of just leave it in second and then kind of give it gas and just it was kind of whatever which there were cars that I think were louder than me um, and what ends up happening is is a lot of people perceive more high-pitched frequencies to be louder than low pitch so your V8s and stuff like that they'll think oh it's not that loud when in reality it's just as loud um, if not louder but uh, that's that's just something that people perceive as uh, something that happens so as unfortunate as it is you know I had to do what I needed to do um, but uh, either way it was a fun time their timing was not working it was some semi working wasn't working it was kind of all over the place so um, it is what it is and I got a little more seat time into it which is fine and I'm really glad that I was able to kind of do it because I just got up went down to the um, to the amphitheater where they had it raced came back home and was able to finish off my Sunday so it was nice uh, and I was able to work one of the corners with Austin and we were just you know talking shop and just grabbing cones and kind of uh, uh, Enjoying the time that we were out there So if you got a buddy who you can go with to do some of these track days and you have to you know be a, a, a cone a cone person or a, or Snagging cones and stuff like that to reset them. Yeah, go with a friend. Honestly, it makes it much more go much more faster and um, It just makes the day um, kind of go by pretty quickly and then you're into driving uh, but will I do it again? Uh, I believe I will. It's just kind of tough, especially in the lot that they're in. Uh, it's kind of small, so you can't really get... It's a lot more technical, and, you know, the smaller cars have a little bit more of an advantage uh, than, you know, my car, right? And so, um, and it kind of bogs the car down enough to where I may need to jump back to first gear. And uh, we all, you know, if you've ever autocrossed, that's usually never a good thing. Uh, but... You know it is what it is we work with what we got uh, but yeah so just wanted to kind of recap the day um, you know I had my subwoofer flying all over the place and I had to go take that off and uh, make sure that that wasn't uh, gonna you know uh, mess up the the trunk or anything so um, other than that I appreciate you guys watching I'm trying to get these videos out as much as I can um, there's gonna be a lot more of this where I kind of recap something kind of months in advance uh, just because at the time either I didn't have time to finish it off or we were kind of in a hurry and you know those things tend to happen um, or footage wasn't um, saved uh, my GoPros have been acting weird and it's been hot and if you have a GoPro and you try and record in anything that's not like you know anything that's 4k those things overheat easily so I'm trying to figure out a way to fix that but from what it looks like I don't I don't think I'll be able to find something that'll keep it cool um, but uh, again thank you guys for watching and uh, appreciate everybody um, subscribing and uh, commenting you know we have over 500 uh, subscribers which is really cool um, it gives me some sort of perks I don't know what they are but We'll see what we can do and, I don't know, try and grow the channel a little bit more and, you know, maybe get to a thousand and then maybe we can get it monetized and that will help make more videos and can do more things. So we'll see. Um, but, you know, I do this for fun and to give information. So as you all know, if there's something cool that can come out of it, great. If not, I'm not worried about it. Uh, but yeah, guys, I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate you guys um, with the comments and stuff like that. And uh I'll have more videos out, so until then, we'll see you guys on the next one.